This is Sea Life. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back to our channel. Um, today we went over and helped a friend burn off some more of their property. And um, so we came back home and we're getting out of the truck and we're going to get started on the last little bit of this roof. We'll see if we can actually put the finishing touches on and, and have it done so we can do a move in video. I can't wait. <laughs> okay, so the first thing is to get a scaffold set up. And Daniel has this idea that he is going to use his trailer and build a scaffold. I thought that sounded pretty cool. So we'll see how this goes. Let's just put it up on a, a, a block. Oh, oh, okay. He says that's just where it wound up at. Let me see. So, okay. And he said, we may not do anything but just set up the scaffold today, but as long as it doesn't rain tomorrow, we'll... It's rain, but it'll be evening. Or, or so if it, I'm thinking I'll be able to get a bunch done. But I might need a little push. At the other end. Uh, uh -huh. Actually, he is He Man. <laughs> that trailer's not too, too heavy no, when it's, it's empty. Annoying at trying to. Yeah, I need like a little boost. We got our makeshift scaffold. And now all I'm gonna do is just take some um, two bys and run them this way across it. And then I'm gonna set a ladder on top of it with, uh, with uh, some boards inside that ladder. It's, and it'll, it'll keep us from, or it'll be a good scaffold. And it'll be roll, but I gotta take um, my jack stands and put it up underneath the bumper on that so it don't stand up on it. Okay. And that it'll be good to go. So it'll be a portable scaffold. Yeah. Cool. So I'm trying to kind of walk around it and show you. He's just cut little notches in this wood and put it into the trailer holder uh, notches. And now he's going to continue on and, and build it out so that they can use it hopefully tomorrow as a portable scaffold. And that sounds so nice. And it didn't cost me a dime. So hey, that's even better. The weatherman did say that uh, there would be rain today, but Daniel is out here. He's taking his chances and he's progressing with this scaffold build anyway. And uh, so we're still at it. I don't know if you can see it or not. Let me see. We've got some redneck bracing going on here. We're just using everything we have to build what we need. So we've got some old electric fencing and some fence posts. And, and here Daniel's getting ready to try this out. It looks like he's putting the ladder up. We'll see. He'll put some wood over that ladder probably. And that will be his little scaffold. His portable, portable scaffold. I'm gonna stand back and watch. We'll see. 
how this goes. And as he tries it out, he may decide to add more to it or something. Who knows? But we'll see. He's mostly using his scrap wood and whatever he's got around the house. And there you go. This is Daniel's first try of his scaffold. How does it feel, Daniel? It feels pretty good, he says. And it's not moving. Okay, then. That's the important thing. Get a better picture. There you go. Okay. Yeah. So I don't know if you heard Daniel, Daniel. but he uh, he said he's gonna need somebody to stand on the scaffold and hand him tiles up to the roof. So that will probably be my job. Just my luck. But uh, we did call our friend, but he said he was working for somebody else today. So, well, we'll see how that goes. Or we might get Jacob in on it. I don't know. Yeah, he's thinking that might work out real good to have one person. Daniel got that burn from doing that fire working and we've been putting essential oils on it and it's actually helping been putting pure foot's called purification on there it seems to be helping so that's great he's not itching or anything today now he's got to get down that's, the, that's gonna be the, the sure thing here <laughs> yeah, getting up and down off the of scaffolds has been tricky. He's got a set of chair in the back of the trailer. That's an idea. Okay. Let's see how this ingenuity plays out. Okay. Just it out a little spot and angles up. And he wants me to come up there so he can hand stuff to me and I can stack them. So I'm going to climb up in the back of this trailer and I'm going to try to do that for him. I worked myself up into this corner on purpose. So I'm running one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten rows right here. But I've left it here because i got to finish that somehow. And now i got to figure out how I'm going to do it. Unless I wait until I get this all done then come back and run along here. I'm trying not to do that. That way, spend less time on the scaffold, probably be faster. But I gotta figure it out first, then we can get rolling. Well, I'll come back once I uh, figure out how I am going to do this. We had to move the trailer because I need my scaffold down here. Because uh, we're Getting to the end, I want to show you here in a minute, but all I did was I 
took the blocks out from underneath the uh, back of the trailer that's supporting the back so it doesn't tip up on me. And then I just picked it up and rolled it on back. And then I had to just readjust a few things so it's not rocky when we get up there. I'm just gonna have to watch that I don't step out on that end down there. But other than that, we should be good. And I'm going to actually get on the roof by using the scaffold. Right now I'm standing on the scaffold. As you see. She's helping today. But uh, I've made it all the way from that far in. There's 10 rows. I went all the way from over there to right here, doing 10 rows at a time. And I think that should take almost all of it. I should finish. I'm getting close anyway. But uh, we just got to run this out. I'm going to, once I get over in here, I'll bring, just start working it this way and then work from the scaffold to finish the rooftop. And then we'll have to run the scaffold along it again to finish out the edge. But we're almost there. Well, we did it. We found the corner. We'll come back tomorrow or sometime this week and just do the trim of it. But we're expecting rain tomorrow and I got the roof done. The roof done. Just gotta trim it up. But uh, thank you for watching and oh man, this looks gorgeous. Oh yeah. I wish I could show it from above more because uh, it's just beautiful like this. Well, thank you for watching and uh, God bless.